Well, Eric Nicky, this started as the district attorney put a survey on his own website asking residents to fill out a form if they've been negatively impacted by 16 specific encampments across the city of Sacramento. He told me they got 500 responses in just the last 24 hours, which prompted him to start this investigation. Things have gotten better. They've gotten worse. Sacramento County District Attorney Tin Ho's assessment of the homeless crisis within city limits. Dating back a few years and in the few weeks since he sent a complaint letter to city council members outlining attacks against county employees in front of their downtown offices. One of my employees was threatened walking back from court. Um, after the letters had been sent out, there was a court reporter that was assaulted at Cesar Chavez Park in the farmer's market. After hearing from downtown business owners and rapid responses from residents claiming homeless encampments are disrupting their daily lives. One response was from a mother who was unable to sleep because her children were scared to go to the park across the street. Ho tells Fox 40 he's seen and heard enough. We have to have compliance with laws and rules so that it doesn't negatively impact the community. The DA is launching an investigation into adherence to two city codes centered around public nuisances. If someone creates or allow a public nuisance on their property that affects the well-being and the safety of the community, they can be held accountable. And punished up to six months in prison or fined up to $1,000. It isn't clear how he could charge city officials with these misdemeanor offenses. I think the DA's actions is really, um, is really grandstanding to tell you the truth. Bob Erlenbush, a homeless advocate in Sacramento, isn't buying what the DA is selling. So far, it seems like the worst manifestation of finger pointing. In his mind, it's the latest round in what he calls an ongoing blame game between city and county efforts to improve resources for the unhoused. Homeless people are invisible in all of this. Erlenbush tells Fox 40 he thinks a looming threat of litigation is a political ploy by Ho to signal city sweeps of encampments. So it's a lose-lose for homeless people. Leaving them nowhere to go. And I reached out to Mayor Daryl Steinberg's office for response to uh, Ho's investigation and was told that he is out of the office tonight. But Ho, in speaking with him, he did tell me he doesn't want this to get to the point of litigation if it doesn't have to. What he does want is for the city to create a safe space for its residents and its unhoused. Reporting in Sacramento, covering local news that matters. I'm Mason Morrow, Fox 40 News. Mm -hmm.